uh, paper money is a unit of account that should be used as a measurement in trade. It's not particularly a store of value. But this is not a book about gold, it's a book about collapsed currencies, how currencies have collapsed over the years, and the reasons they have totally went worthless. It's a book about money. Once you lose confidence in that money, a lot gets shattered. I got a little off center there. Do you think there will ever come a time when U.S. dollars are worthless? I don't care to even discuss that. That's not my subject. That's not my point of view. What I think personally is my own thoughts and really mean, really mean nothing. What would you say your message is in the book, your core message? Know how your money got the way it got and prepare yourself. It's your life. You're responsible for it. No one's going to take care of you. Uh, when I first opened the store, I'd get all these people coming into my store with accents, talking about the collapsed currencies. Now I have to get a new batch of notes here. I'll cut some more. We'll chop that and get the leader's head, too. Oh, now we can get the leader and the serial number. Let's show here the Banco de Mexico, yes. That'll be nice on the spine. I wouldn't want to buy a real rare note, because... I'm not a collector of notes. I, I'm, <clears throat> I'm, I'm kind of up in age now, so it's, it can be a dangerous business if they think you have money. So, gold's drying up in a lot of source, sources. Very hard to replace inventory. Very hard. I find it interesting. Hopefully, it's just an anomaly. If not, this is history. <laughs>